Yeah, hey guys, it's Mike Kampner, Northern Michigan Walleye and Panfish Productions, Ice Report. I'm trying to go US 10 South because US 10 North seems like a lot of the medium, the, the medium, small, good, unless there's lots of springs and whatnot. Uh, Lake Mitchell, Lake Cadillac, Masaki. Now today I was over at Masaki. I noticed that there was machines out on the ice. So now am I saying it's super safe? Don't worry about it. Run all over the lake. I'm not saying that whatsoever. All right, hey guys. All right, we're out here at Big Lake. Big Lake in the Osceola County Everett area, it's just uh, east of Everett. Anyways, we got uh, we got some crummy ice here. I don't. Once you get, you see that this is. Like you can see the snow's all gone. This isn't bad ice. It's not great ice. It's probably three inches. But once you get out there where that snow is, two hits and I'm in the, uh, I, I go through it, you know. So unfortunately, Big Lake isn't ready quite yet, at least at, their, at the access point here. Now maybe over there where I'm uh, shooting there on the uh, south side of the lake, maybe it's a little better over there. I know it's a little shallower over there. Yeah, this isn't good ice. I mean, there's a chunk that comes up on the top. It's kind of punky. You can see. Well, it's not too bad, but it's a certain spot. Really uneven. I don't like it. This is this is the kind of ice that can get you in trouble. But anyways, we're out here on Big Lake, and we're doing a nice check for you guys. I got about three three inches here, but like I said, it's not the greatest ice, and there's nobody out here. Which, you know, that doesn't matter, but it's, it's all comes down to the ice and the quality of the ice. And I'd say this quality of ice is about 50%. 50% good, 50% bad. So, you know, you're looking at an inch and a half of good ice, and then you got another inch and a half or so of some punk ice that's on top of it. It's just not that good. But the good news is it's supposed to stay cold, and it'll continue to grow, but we do have a... We do have some snow coming in tonight, uh, late tonight, early in the morning. That could mess things up pretty bad for this lake because it needs, it just needs time to freeze and no snow. But unfortunately, it sounds like we're going to be getting some snow, quite a bit of wind. So that's good. The wind will help keep a lot of this snow off this lake and it'll definitely improve it. But uh, that's the report here on Big Lake. Just not quite there yet, but it's getting there. We just need, we just need some more days of cold and then we'll be on this lake fishing. Anyways, guys, that's it for this one. On to the next lake. Tight lines. Out another lake, Jensen Lake. I had a subscriber ask asked me if I could go out and check Jensen Lake. And I'm out here right now about, well, about that far from the truck. I'd say I'm probably 50, 70 yards out. It looks like there's been some a guy taking his you know, jet sled or whatever out here. It looks like he got out here a little ways and then he popped some holes here. I'm out here and it looks like to be about uh, two and a half, three inches. It's good ice. I'm gonna go out a little further. Just check it here, make sure. Yeah, we're good. Three hits. I don't have my float suit on today, so gotta be careful. Okay, not bad, not bad. I'm out here now about 80 yards or so, 80, 90 yards. He's got a hole here. I don't think he went out much farther than this though. Oh. Checking ice. Nobody on the lake, but it's kind of late. In, it's kind of late in the game here, late in the day. It's probably about five, five o'clock or so. Well, it looks like there's been a couple guys out here. He went out. He got out here a little ways. I don't know if he caught anything. Looks like he was probably here over the weekend. So a little further here. Some pretty good ice, you know. For first ice, it's first ice. So you gotta be careful. Gonna go swimming. Okay, now that's punky. That's two hits. So I'm gonna back up. So yeah, you get out there about 85 yards and she starts to get sketchy. So, so yeah, you can't get out there too far. I can't get out much farther than 
where I'm at right now, you can see the guy, the guy was fishing right here. See his, where, he, where his hole is, where he was. So, so yeah, I mean, this is Jensen Lake. Now, am I saying that this whole lake is, is like this? I'm not saying that one bit, but where I'm sitting, you know, where I'm standing on it, decent ice out a little ways and then like I said once I got past where he went because that's probably where he checked it to and it was bad so he fished there that's the report on Jensen Lake it's going to need some more time hopefully you don't get all that snow if it gets all that snow it could get ugly unfortunately you go you go south of US 10 it's not looking good it's not looking the best this isn't a very deep lake either yeah it's a bummer Try to get back out maybe tomorrow or uh, the next day. Tight lines, everybody. Fish on.